complication related updates in this release. I'm adding a timer complication. It's under clock. Timer. We can choose which cloud it goes to. So I select the favorite cloud and you can see I have selective ambient mode. I selected to show this complication on the ambient face to press the center to return to the watch face. Okay, so you see the new complication appeared and I can tap on it to open the corresponding app and start the timer. It's a 20 minute timer now. Let me return to the watch face and remove the notification and you can see the timer complication is updated every second and it shows up in ambient mode and it also gets updated in ambient mode. Bubble Cloud has a smart refresh feature which will check each complication and if it detects that the complication displays static information that doesn't change it will not waste battery power on refreshing those. Their refresh frequency will be lower to save battery but if a complication is detected to update often it will uh, be refreshed that often. There's another kind of complication that we can add to the watch face and it's, the, it's in the favorite cloud settings. At the bottom we can have the watch face image that we have right now. We can have just a color. If we tap here again we can actually change that color if we want. We have the time-based color which changes the background color by the minute of the hour. There are two different color set. This one is the constant. In the first 15 minutes the watch face is going to be green, then blue, then yellow and in the last 15 minutes of every hour it's going to be red. Or you have a smooth changing color bar. You can see the background color of the background title there showing you how the different colors correspond. And now we have the circle plus uh, selection, a fourth option. You remember the circle plus in my application denotes complications. So the circle plus here lets you use background image complications. One that came with your watch is the element background image complication. But there are other options here. We can set the now playing background image complication which will use the album art if you are listening to music or watch some media on your phone. And you can install other applications which provide image complications. For example this moon phase image complication. It's the Mooney app, that free app that you can install on your Android Wear 2.0 watch. It shows the moon phases as the background. And another cool one is the weather background. It will just pick a photo based on the current weather. It's night right now, so I have these night skies. It's going to get updated from time to time. The weather channel application does the update. So this is really cool. One last thing that I would like to show you that is new in this version of the app is the ability to have multiple colors in the digital clock. So let me go there. We go to the clock settings. I can select the single row digital clock and you can already see the minutes and the hours have different colors. And if I enable the seconds, they can be a third color if you choose. Then here 
the those little pallets control the color of these uh, parts of the time and if you want you can disable the separator colors and let me just go to a.m. p.m. instead and if we return to the watch face and I show you the ambient screen you can probably tell that the colors are different here also